Hey, so one of my little side uh, projects uh, you guys may have heard about, I don't think I actually announced it yet, it's called Mars VR. Uh, have I talked about that here? No? Okay, so go to marsvr.io, and it's, it's a project uh, sponsored by the, the Mars Society, and uh, we recently flew out to, uh, to Idaho uh, to scan the Mars District Research Station. So it's a little over a square mile, it's actually like a mile and a half of actual physical terrain, we had a fleet of, of drones and uh, Oz uh, Balabanian, you may know him, he's a pretty well-known uh, photogrammetry guy, was out there and we scanned the inside and the outside of this uh, desert research station, which is effectively where uh, citizen astronauts go to train. And we're building a platform which is a VR training platform for the uh, people to go and Try. I mean, when they go there, they actually wear spacesuits. They go through airlocks. They they really simulate being life on Mars. So, point being, and to this to this audience and uh, to high fidelity uh, audience is that this is going to be opened up as a as an open source project once we have the the, the terrain data in and the, and the buildings in for anybody to develop um, missions. So, training missions like the first one we're going to do is you know how to get in a spacesuit, and the second one will be how to clear the airlock. And, but then we need a, you know, a bunch of community uh, contributions for people to, to build uh, emissions moving forward. So anyway, check it out. Still, we're still doing the, the scans and stitching things together. I don't know that anybody's ever done a, a landscape this big uh, with photogrammetry at this level of detail, but it's somewhat impossible, but we're, we're making progress. So anyway, marsvr.io.